Okay, show that 3 plus square root of 2 divided by 5 plus square root of 8 can be written as 11 minus square root of 2 over 17. <coughs> Right, the first, first thing I want to draw my attention to is that the square root of 8 here, okay? Square root of 8 is not in its simplest form, okay? I can turn that into uh, the square root of 4 times the square root of 2. Square root of 4 we know is 2, so I can change that into 2 square root of 2. So I'm actually going to rewrite that as 3 plus the square root of 2 over 5 plus 2 square root of 2. Just means later on things might go on. nice. Now... If you look at this one here, I've got a 17 on the bottom. That means I need to go on to a way of getting rid of this square root 2. Now, the only way we would do that is by doing the uh, difference of two squares. So it's going to be 5 minus 2 square root 2 over 5 minus 2 square root 2. So this fraction here equals 1. And then we've got to work out your numerator, and we've got to work out the denominator. Right, I'm going to do the numerator first, because the numerator is um, 3 plus square root of 2 in brackets in brackets 5 minus 2 square root of 2 uh, 3 times 5 is 15 3 times a negative 2 square root of 2 is actually negative 6 square root of 2 uh, so that should be 2 so no, square root of 2 times 5 is uh, 5 square root of 2 okay um, 2 times square root of 2 is uh, minus 4 okay and 15 minus 4 is 11 minus 6 square root 2 plus 5 square root 2 that you minus square root 2 okay so that's my numerator done uh, looking at our denominator we've got 5 plus 2 square root 2 multiplied by 5 minus 2 square root 2 um, because this is a difference of two squares, we could expand it and we'll find out that the two middle terms are all cancelled out. Okay, but five and five squared is twenty-five. Now this might be a bit confusing, so I'm going to write it a little bit. I'm going to write it up here. So two square root two times two square root two. Okay, uh, two times two is four. Okay, square root two times square root two is two. So two times four is eight. Um, it's always going to be a minus. So it's minus 8. 25 minus 8 is 17. Okay, so thus, plus, um, if that's my numerator, it's going to be 11 minus square root 2, and that's my denominator, which is 17. Thank you.